Money. When it comes to mass transit, uh, we have been woefully inadequate in this state. Uh, uh, and this governor has run away from the transportation issue just like her predecessor uh, uh, did. Uh, and, and there is no better sign of that uh, in transportation in general uh, than the governor's failure to honor her own word uh, in a letter to uh, Congressman Joe Courtney about Route 11. Uh, here's the letter. She said it was vital. She said she would get it done. She has failed to do that. In fact, she has reneged on her promise to the people of this uh, district. Just as she, uh, uh, at the very last minute, uh, having stopped Shoreline East from extending to New London for, for several years, she says, well, now she's in, in favor of it. The reality is this governor does not understand transportation. If she did, 95 would work better. If she did, we'd be putting light rail systems in. If she did, we'd have better bus services. Service. If she did, we'd be looking at trolley systems in our major cities. If she did, we would be doing things entirely differently than we're currently doing them. Now, you know, in my own city of Stanford, we established bus service in and out of the rail station because we knew the state was not going to build a, a good delivery system, so we built it. We need a governor who's going to act like that. It's not a question of how we fund it. We're, we, we need to fund it. We know that uh, we uh, subsidize uh, uh, highways, we subsidize cars, we subsidize buses, but we don't want to subsidize to the same extent rail. We're going to have to subsidize it to some extent, and we're going to have to collect uh, 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 fares from, from, from people. Uh, and we're, after, we're actually going to have to go after the dollars that are currently available to do that. Uh, the reality is, is the uh, Amtrak has a great interest in the reintroduction of uh, 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 a second track on that line, uh, as well as uh, seeing additional services uh, provided. One of the great problems about Connecticut and this governor and her predecessor is we have failed to do environmental impact statements on our rail bed. We will not get some, some rapid rail uh, monies that the, the federal government's going to give out in the next uh, 60 to 90 days because we didn't do an environmental impact uh, a statement on most of the rail system in the state of uh, Connecticut. When that happens, and you he heard it here first, the, the governor will be held up to ridicule because she stopped that from happening. What we need is a proactive governor who understands this state has to be linked using mass transit.